Helen Keller was born in 1880 in Tuscumbia, a small town in Alabama, USA. As a baby, she was healthy and full of life. However, when she was just 19 months old, a severe illness robbed her of both her sight and hearing, leaving her in a world of darkness and silence. Her parents, Arthur and Kate Keller, were devastated by the news. They sought medical help, but no treatment could restore Helen's lost senses. Despite the challenges, Kate refused to give up hope for her daughter's future. Kate Keller heard of a remarkable teacher named Anne Sullivan, who had experience working with blind and deaf children. Determined to help her daughter, Kate contacted Anne and persuaded her to come to Tuscumbia to work with Helen. In March 1887, Anne Sullivan arrived at the Keller home. She immediately began working with Helen, using a method known as fingerspelling. With Helen's hand under hers, and spelled out words letter by letter, hoping to connect Helen with the world around her. At first, Helen was resistant to Anne's efforts. Frustrated by her inability to communicate, she lashed out in anger and confusion. But Anne remained patient and persistent, refusing to give up on her young student. One day, while pumping water from a well, and spelled out the word water into Helen's hand. As the cool water flowed over Helen's hand, she made the connection between the word and the sensation. In that moment, the world opened up to her in a way she had never experienced before. With Anne's help, Helen quickly learned to communicate using finger spelling. She voraciously consumed books and eagerly absorbed knowledge about the world around her. As her understanding of language grew, so did her thirst for learning. Helen's remarkable progress captured the attention of the public. Newspapers wrote about her inspiring story, and people from all over the world marveled at her achievements. Despite her disabilities, Helen proved that with determination and perseverance, anything was possible. Throughout her life, Helen Keller was a tireless advocate for the rights of people with disabilities. She traveled the world, giving speeches and lectures on behalf of those who could not speak for themselves. She also wrote several books, including her autobiography, The Story of My Life. Helen Keller's legacy continues to inspire millions of people around the world. Her story is a testament to the power of perseverance, courage, and the human spirit. Helen Keller's journey from a dark and silent world to one of light and understanding is a testament to the indomitable human spirit. Despite facing unimaginable challenges, she never lost hope or gave up on her dreams. Her story serves as a beacon of hope for all those who struggle against adversity, reminding us that with perseverance and determination, anything is possible.